Hello everyone, welcome to a new vlog. We are on another van trip. This is a little bit spontaneous of us because this weekend, right now, I'm meant to be doing the New Forest Fairy Festival, but quite last minute it was cancelled, unfortunately. We got the email two days ago. So we thought, well, Chris had got the time off work and we'd already sort of planned to come away in the van, but, but instead of doing the festival stall, we just thought we'd enjoy the weekend. This time we, we didn't want to go too far, we're just going away for two nights. So we're actually still in Somerset, even though it's taken us about two hours to get here. We're in a little place called Linf Linford? Yeah. What's on the side of it? It says know. visit the Glen Lynn Gorge. It doesn't oh, actually say yeah. the name of the town. I think it's Linford. Linmouth, that's the one. Lynn. which is this really cute little fishing village and we've been around the shops bought a couple of Christmas presents which is nice and had fish and chips <laughs> so we were debating whether to get out and do some photographs for Instagram but we can't be bothered <laughs> so I think we might be leaving that for today so Lynmouth is as far west of Somerset as you can go pretty much and we're on some might say the coast but others might just say the edge of the Bristol Channel um, <laughs> so it's sort of by the sea which is nice we like being by the sea that's what we're doing this weekend and I thought I'd bring you along with us morning we had a lovely but blustery night uh, on Exmoor last night and now we've come to Dunster Castle yeah we came once before with the kids but um, not for some time so it'd be quite nice to see it the oh, sun is right in my eyes I can't see a thing <laughs> morning hey, morning morning <laughs> So we've come into the town of Dunster itself. So I'm a bit excited because this is where they filmed a Poirot episode called The Cornish Mystery. And at the end, Inspector Jap stands here and Poirot is going off on the back of a cart and Jap goes, <laughs> uh, yeah, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is one of my favourite bits, isn't it? <laughs> it's got me so happy, it's not normal. <laughs> Poirot and Hastings stood at one of these windows. <laughs> this is the sign I need. Apparently there's a Norman font in there and it's a 14th century tower. So 
so we've got a bit lost. <laughs> we were trying to find um, Horner Woods, which is a National Trust car park and National Trust place, as you might expect from us. And uh, we ended up here with this gorgeous view. Sun's about to set, but we've lost all the lovely light, which so we've been running around taking a few photos. And I think we've got some, a couple of nice ones. So that's where we are now, but we're now gonna go head back into Dunster because I reserved a table for our evening meal, so that should be nice. But, oh, I love being in Woodland. We need to find some more places nearer to us with some wider roads to get there. <laughs> that would be nice. But if there's no spaces there, I'm not hopeful that there will be spaces around the corner. Well, unfortunately, I sort of messed up with the booking in Dunster. There was nowhere to park. We went up and down, up and down a couple of times, so I had to cancel that booking. So we ended up somewhere called the Hairy... Is it the Hairy Hello. Dog? What's it called? Oh yeah, the Hairy Dog. You're the right. Hairy Dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time since I've been in a pub with bouncers at the door. <laughs> but the food was fine, wasn't it? Yeah. It was quite nice, really. So we ended up, yeah. Did I say in Minehead? Did I say we were in Minehead? No, we were in Minehead, which is not very far from Dunster at all, but quite a different vibe. <laughs> <laughs> what did she say? I'm not getting it out of her f***ing it's not even in there. Oh, really? <laughs> Lovely. <Yeah. laughs> Good morning. Well, it's actually um, half past one, so it's not quite morning anymore. So we had quite a late morning because both Chris and I woke up in the night and couldn't get back off. I don't know. I don't know why. Well, I had a book idea or a story idea going around in my head and that kept me awake and Chris woke up after a funny dream and, and couldn't get back off. So we actually had quite a late morning and then we drove across Exmoor following the River X to get to Exeter, <laughs> which is funny because we've never actually been to Exeter. We've driven round it, we've sort of stopped on the outskirts, um, but never been in Exeter so we thought we'd come and have a look and see what there actually is. We're thinking about doing up our house a bit more so we thought we'd have a look at the John Lewis. Yeah so that's why we came here. It's another, uh, it's another lovely day, a bit chillier than yesterday but still sunny so that's nice. So I'm not going to take you with me around the shops because I don't want to carry a camera with me so I'll just say goodbye for now. I don't think we've got any other stops planned, I think after this we're just going home um, but it's been a really good weekend. Guess what? What? We have amassed yet another celebrity friend. Uh. You've driven a lot. Well done. Thank you. Shall I end the vlog then? Bowls. Well, we're back. I feel like this vlog is like going to be two minutes long. We've been two nights, about just about two days, and I feel like I just haven't vlogged very much or said very much or done very much. So this will be a nice little short one, I expect. We've been listening to, we've just discovered Chris and Rosie Ramsey's podcast called Shagged, Married, Annoyed. It was really funny. I um, definitely recommend that one. Now me and Chris are thinking about doing a podcast, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> Any ideas for a title name or what we could actually talk about, <laughs> please put them in the comments. <laughs> so Exeter was really lovely, we're definitely going to go back. We, we only had a couple of hours because the only car park we could find that without a height restriction had a two hour limit. So we just had a quick look around, um, yeah they've pretty much got everything in Exeter, all the shops that I'd want to go in, probably. Definitely more to explore. We didn't see the cathedral, we didn't see the castle. I didn't even know Exeter had a castle. 
there we are we learned something new every day but it was a really nice weekend though wasn't it lovely yeah it's better to do that than sit at home being annoyed about the fairy festival not being on so i'm glad that we did it now i just got to unpack though yeah mm. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you're new here and hit the little bell notification so you get told when I upload a new video. And I will see you again next time. Bye.